the U.S. Coast Guard just revealing that they believe they have recovered human remains as they recover the wreckage of that sub that imploded near the Titanic. Human remains appear to have been found in debris of the Titan submersible, which was recovered from the floor of the Atlantic on Wednesday. Investigators hope the wreckage will help. The debris is consistent with the catastrophic... Imagine yourself diving into the depths of the ocean, uncovering the hidden secrets in its dark waters. This was the daring mission of OceanGate and its submarine, the impressive Titan. Embarking on never-before-explored adventures, the company was founded in 2009 by the visionary Stockton Rush, whose passion for the ocean was almost hereditary, coming from ancestors who played important roles in the history of the United States. Rush, a true adventurer, had a thirst for exploring the unknown, and even with the emerging opportunity of space tourism, he found himself fascinated by the underwater world. Determined to go beyond the stars, he dived into the waters near Seattle in his own mini-submarine, discovering wonders and mysteries that further fueled his curiosity. Seeing a business opportunity in private ocean exploration, Rush founded OceanGate, a company that rented submarines to researchers and enabled tourists to become citizen scientists on underwater expeditions. In 2010, his vision began to come true when he led his first tourist trip to Catalina Island, California, with expert guides enriching the visitor's experience. But Rush's ambition was greater, to build the Titan submarine, capable of reaching the ocean's most mysterious depths, including the wreckage of the famous Titanic. In 2021, his dream was finally becoming a reality, but he had no idea what fate had in store for him. On June 18th, 2023, a terrible event shook the Titan's mission. The submarine was swallowed by the abyss it was trying to illuminate, resulting in a tragedy of devastating proportions. What caused this accident? Who was the man behind this ambitious project? And what was he seeking in the depths of the sea? OceanGate Expeditions was a company that offered an incredible experience taking its clients on board the Titan submarine, the most advanced in the world, to see up close the remains of the famous ship, Titanic, which sank in 1912. The Titan was a marvel of engineering, capable of withstanding the immense pressure of the ocean's depths and performing various tasks, such as 3D mapping of the Titanic's wreckage and retrieving historical objects following all necessary rules and authorizations. In April 2023, Ocean Gate Expeditions released a video on YouTube showcasing the advantages of traveling with the Titan and ensuring maximum safety for its passengers. The video was posted on the company's official channel and invited interested parties to become part of the crew, receiving specialized training and diving to the location where the Titanic lay. The narrator's voice said, Ocean Gate Expeditions offers a unique opportunity to be part of the crew with specialized training and safe dives to the Titanic wreckage. The video displayed images of Ocean Gate staff, satisfied customers, and the Titan itself, which seemed unbeatable in exploring the depths of the sea. No one could predict what would happen two months later when a tragedy shook the world. On June 18, 2023, the Titan exploded during one of its dives to the Titanic, killing the five people on board, including Ocean Gate Expedition's founder, Stockton Rush. Before the accident, there were warning signs regarding the safety of the Titan. In 2018, a group of 38 experts in underwater vehicles from the Marine Technology Society sent a letter to Stockton Rush, expressing concerns about the development of the Titan. Additionally, some of the passengers who traveled with the Titan before the explosion reported technical issues and communication failures during the dives. These facts raise questions about the causes and responsibilities behind the Titan's explosion, which claimed the lives of five people. The story of the Titanic and the Titan, both built with cutting-edge technology and with the purpose of exploring the wonders of the ocean, ultimately met a tragic fate in the depths Let's begin with the Titanic, the famous ship that sank in 1912, taking more than 1,500 lives with it. The Titanic was a symbol of luxury and elegance, the largest and most sophisticated passenger ship of its time. It departed from Southampton, England, bound for New York City, USA, on its first and final voyage. 
On the way, it collided with an iceberg in the North Atlantic and sank in less than three hours. This was one of the greatest maritime disasters in history, causing a tremendous global commotion. The sinking of the Titanic also led to changes in ship safety regulations, resulting in the creation of an international agreement to protect human life at sea. The submarine Titan was a true marvel of engineering, capable of diving into the depths of the ocean, where the legendary Titanic lay at a depth of about 12,000 meters. Its mission was to explore the remains of the famous sunken ship, capturing three-dimensional images and collecting objects for study and preservation. In this narrative, we will follow the Titan on its final journey, a day that would go down in the history of navigation. Operated by Ocean Gate, the Titan submarine embarked on a bold expedition to the depths of the North Atlantic with the aim of visiting the location where the RMS Titanic rested eternally. Launched from the MV Polar Princess, which left Senes on June 16, 2023, the Titan arrived at the dive site the following day. On June 18, the Titan began its descent, while the crew was filled with anticipation and excitement for what they were about to witness. However, about one hour and 45 minutes after the dive began, a tragedy occurred. Communication with the Titan was suddenly lost and it did not resurface at the scheduled time. Hope dwindled rapidly and a colossal effort was made to locate the Titan and its crew. The news of the disappearance spread quickly, triggering a media frenzy and a race against time. Our urgency to find and rescue the occupants of the Titan submarine grew with each passing moment. Authorities were alerted, and a search and rescue operation was carried out by an international team led by the United States Coast Guard, United States Navy, and Canadian Coast Guard. They were supported by aircraft from the Royal Canadian Air Force and the United States Air National Guard, as well as a vessel from the Royal Canadian Navy and several research vessels and remotely operated underwater vehicles. After four days of tireless searching, a remotely operated underwater vehicle located a debris field containing parts of the Titan approximately 500 meters away from the Titanic wreckage. During the operation, the United States Navy detected a sonar signal indicating an explosion that occurred around the time communications with the submarine ceased. It was concluded that the pressure hull of the submarine resulted in the instant death of the five occupants. This tragic event reminds us of the dangers of the deep sea and the risks involved in ocean exploration. The implosion of the Titan submarine near the Titanic wreckage creates an emotional connection between two maritime tragedies separated by more than a century. The loss of the Titan submarine was not just a maritime disaster, but also a personal tragedy for the families of the crew members. Their loved ones are devastated by this loss. Harden, one of the crew members, had shared his pride in being part of the mission on social media just one day before this tragedy. The loss has been deeply felt in maritime and ocean exploration communities. Despite the engineering marvels and courage of the explorers, this painful event reminds us that ocean exploration is filled with challenges and risks. May this tragedy serve as a reminder that the pursuit of the unknown requires care meticulous planning, and respect for the unpredictable forces of the deep sea. May the brave souls of the occupants of the Titan submarine rest in peace, and may their stories inspire the continued search for knowledge and understanding of the vast and mysterious ocean. As we unravel the mysteries of the tragic incident, it is crucial to comprehend the magnitude of events that led to the implosion of the Titan submarine. The leadership of the United States Coast Guard conducted a thorough investigation into the implosion of this submarine operated by Ocean Gate. The Maritime Investigation Board took on the task of analyzing and testing all evidence, including fragments recovered from the ocean floor. The Titan was an engineering feat constructed with strong materials such as carbon fiber and titanium and designed to withstand the tremendous pressures of the deep sea. However, it was discovered that the hull originally planned to reach a depth of 4,000 meters was reduced to 3,000 meters due to signs of wear. Ocean Gate did not seek certification for the submarine, claiming that strict safety protocols limited their innovations. 
A specialist strongly urged OceanGate to abandon its grand ambitions and prioritize the laws of physics. They understood the immense pressures and stresses present in the deep sea environment and warned that taking shortcuts, ignoring principles, and disregarding underwater conditions were an invitation for disaster. The importance of fully respecting and understanding the laws of physics in the ocean depths, where powerful and unpredictable forces are at play, could not be ignored. However, OceanGate chose to proceed with its plan to build the submarine. Showing confidence and ignoring the concerns of experts who were well aware of the dangers involved. In their quest for adventure, they turned a blind eye to the imminent risks. The hull of the Titan submarine was made of carbon fiber, which OceanGate purchased at a lower price, claiming it was too old for use in airplanes. However, the supplier denied selling such material to the company. The pressure hull of the submarine was made up of two halves of titanium, connected by titanium rings and a cylinder made of carbon fiber. In 2020, the submarine's hull underwent repairs and reconstruction after signs of wear were detected. One of the major concerns that plagued the Titan submarine was the safety and integrity of the vessel. It became evident that OceanGate did not make sufficient efforts to obtain proper certification for the Titan. Company executives, including Stockton Rush, argued that following strict safety protocols could hinder innovation. This stance, however, received harsh criticism for being seen as a complete disregard for the safety and well-being of the crew. The media played a significant role in bringing the incident to the attention of the public. Newspapers, TV programs, and news websites from around the world extensively covered the tragedy, shocking and saddening people. Many sent condolences to the families of the victims and called for accountability. As the wreckage of the Titan submarine was recovered, the United States Coast Guard indicated that human remains were among the debris, making the tragedy even more severe and intensifying the public demand for answers. Facing a crisis, OceanGate had to respond as the future of the company was at stake and its reputation severely damaged. The exploration community, the families of the victims, the public and the maritime community all sought answers. A comprehensive and transparent investigation into the causes of the implosion was demanded, covering design, materials, safety procedures and decisions made by OceanGate executives all thoroughly examined. An inevitable connection is made between the implosion of the Titan submarine and the sinking of the Titanic. Both were tragic events in the North Atlantic involving advanced technology for their respective times. These events also remind us of the power of the ocean and the importance of safety measures. While ambition is admirable, we cannot underestimate the importance of safety and careful engineering. Every device has its lifespan and it is essential to understand its limits and follow appropriate protocols. Safety measures, quality control, and thorough inspections are crucial to reducing risks and avoiding catastrophic failures. However, an important question remains unanswered. Was the Titan submarine a victim of human arrogance, just like the Titanic? Or was it an unfortunate accident that could not have been foreseen? And what did you think of this incident? Share your thoughts with me in the comments. I love reading your opinions. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for updates and do not miss any episodes. Like this video and help us grow. Only then will I be able to continue bringing videos to you.